Hello. I'm going to do a reading of a poem that kind of piggybacks on the last video I made about uh, responding to Sync 1216's video about neuro linguistic programming. And um, kind of has to do with, it kind of, what inspired me was uh, Ken Wilber uh, talk. Um, because, I guess I'll preface. Um, he had a good idea, an understanding of fractal geometry and its implications. Um, if, if we believe that the universe is infinite in a very, um, in the sense of complexification that the Mandelbrot set or any fractal, uh, fractal geometry would, would indicate, um, what it means is is that uh, we can actually view principal natures of infinity. Um, once we identify infinity, we can then get a greater understanding of ourselves. For instance, uh, thought is fractal in nature because the neural network of our brain is fractal in nature. It's, uh, and so is our cells, everything about us is fractal in nature. So if we understand that, we can have a greater understanding of the whole picture, the big picture. And that's really what this is all about, ultimately. I mean, it's about understanding ourselves, but it's also very much about understanding the universe itself. I think that when we... You can't understand yourself without understanding the universe, because they're so linked, they're so tied together, because they are one. You can't see your little self. And this is the other thing, the shadow self, yeah. Um, if, you did not, if, you, if you take a piece of paper and you fold it back, you've denied the totality of the paper. You've denied the totality of yourself. Um, in its full form, we are equal to the universe itself. We are mirrors. Anyway, um, so I have a poem that kind of uh, goes along with this, this, this train of thought. It is a uh, tribute to old poets, and it's called o Old Poets, A Tribute. So, um, old poets would write about God along their chosen deity or idea to Odin or Buddha or Krishna or God but what is God to the millennial man when he is the viewer of infinity? What is divine? And that's a statement. The world is a beautiful thing and so is the viewer, the user and the observer. You are nature experiencing itself. You see and you are made in her likeness. So that's that's uh, the, uh, the train of thought. I really think that I've come across the uh, the coral, the coral uh, strata, whatever you want to call it, the, the coral level of uh, of spiral dynamics. I think I've realized the uh, the next step in integral theory. Um, you know, if anybody wants to, you know. You know, uh, question me on that. I guess not question me, but you know, you know, argue me on that. You know, I'm I'm open to, to debate or whatever. It would just take me a while to respond to the video. Um, so anyway, I'm gone. Peace out.